Good afternoon. The Gambia stands on all protocols to extend its appreciation for participating in the World Food System stock taking moment in the beautiful city of Rome. Excellencies, distinguished delegates, I bring you greetings from His Excellency Adama Barrow, President of the Republic of the Gambia. It is my singular honor and privilege to address this August body on the occasion of the United Nations World Food System Summit Plus Two stock taking moment. Excellencies, the Ministry of Agriculture's approach to agricultural development is the food system approach, which is a homegrown, inclusive, resilient, equitable, and sustainable system. This identifies the portfolio of policies needed and design of instruments that bring benefit across multiple objectives, such as improving the quality of diet, supporting economic development, and adaptation to climate change, along and across the environment, people, input, processes, infrastructure, institutions, markets, and trade. The government of the Gambia is committed to the implementation of the national pathway, emanating from the Food System Summit Dialogues. The road to 2030 is long and full of challenges, and our roadmap developed in 2021 identified about seven milestones which need to be achieved for Gambia to reach food and nutrition security. Excellencies, distinguished delegates, the roadmap of the Food System Transformation Agenda is a five-year plan, 2021-2025, putting into consideration all the seven milestones that are in our pathway. The major implementation gap are human and financial in nature. We have limited experts in the area of irrigation engineers, plant breeders, veterinary doctors, soil and laboratory scientists. The combination of activities of all the players that are spread out in various ministries, departments and agencies is a major challenge. The total budget for the transformation agenda stands at 516275000 with a gap of about 300 million US dollars. Distinguished guests, the Ministry of Agriculture will require assistance and collaboration from the United Nations system uh, for the below uh, issues. The repurposing and harmonization of different policies in different ministries, departments, and agencies that are implied in the food system transformation. Funding, fundraising to close the financial gap of the budget of the roadmap. Facilitating exchange trips to transfer skill and knowledge of good practice on the transformation of the food system elsewhere. Align their program to the food system partners. Distinguished guests, ladies and gentlemen, with this few amongst very many steps that the government has taken to the roadmap we defined, we are committed today more than ever to the global goals and to achieving the targets here. I would like to convey my government's appreciation and gratitude to the United Nations Secretary General, through him the UN agencies, United Nations Resident Coordinator's Office, UNDP, FAO, WFP, for the support given to the Gambia government and its people in the conduct of the Food System Summit. Thank you so much for your attention.